Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back to another episode of Unwind With Me. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and if you do, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm making spaghetti for dinner tonight and I needed to stop and get a few things that we didn't have in the house as well as I picked up some bananas for my girls. This wine from Trader Joe's tastes so good. I've had the peach and this is my first time trying the raspberry, but I heard it's the best. Initially, I brought out this base for the hydrangeas. I decided to get the hydrangeas because I always get roses, uh, specifically red roses, and I wanted to try something a little different, and I'm glad that I did. I thought the first vase was a little too big so I changed it to the smaller vase and the flowers look so much better. I went back in and just made some adjustments to the stems and cut off a few more inches and then after that it was perfect. Thank you. 
After I was done with the flowers, I came upstairs to put on comfortable clothes. I don't know if you like me, girl, but when I'm home, I like to be in comfortable, loose-fitting clothing. So I put on what they call a mumu. Our grandmas used to wear these back in the day, and girl, I wear them now, sometimes. I headed back downstairs because my husband was downstairs watching a movie and I wanted to spend some time with him, so I decided to join. After the movie, it was time to get in the kitchen and start preparing dinner. I lit a candle and don't judge me, girl. I only had a matches, but it's giving a vibe a little bit. What you think? I moved the vase next to the candle and placed them both on this charger and I can say it is definitely giving the vibes. Now I'm just cutting up all the vegetables and seasoning my meat for the meat sauce. I didn't show all the seasoning that I used. Now I'm about to cook the pasta noodles. Um, my family likes angel hair pasta, and to get more noodles without using a whole box, I split the pasta in half. Girl, what's an unwind with me without a glass of wine, right? So I poured me a glass of Moscato and waited just a few minutes while the noodles cook. So while the food was finishing up, I started cleaning the dishes. Let me know down in the comments if you are someone who cleans during or after cooking. Are you like me, girl? And sometimes you just leave those dishes in the sink until the next morning. Let me know down in the comments which one you do. Dinner was done, but no one was ready to eat, so I went ahead and got my girls' clothes ready for school. I was picking out my oldest daughter outfit for a Monday, and then I went into my youngest daughter's room, and I picked out her little cute mermaid dress that she loves so much. So yeah, I went ahead and got their clothes um, picked out and ironed and laid out for them for school. 
and then afterwards they took their baths and shower and they ate dinner afterwards which was an hour after i was done cooking now I'm making me a hubby plate i usually eat corn with my spaghetti but we didn't have any but best believe when i eat this for leftovers i'll be sure to have me some corn After dinner, it was shower time. I'm not going to show you my full shower routine, but if you would like to see a video, let me know down in the comments. Now that I have done all of the things, it's time to get cozy in bed and watch a little Housewives reunion.
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in episode three.